Hey YouTubers, I'm back with a new vlog. This vlog really hits close to home. A few weeks ago I actually shared a story about new beginnings and human compassion. And if you actually didn't read that story, it's a new blog that I posted on my website. I've actually linked it down below if you're interested in checking it out. I want to give a shout out to everybody who's currently in transition, who's looking for new grounding, making peace with their past, letting it fuel their future, starting over. Recently I had to help pack up the house that I had grown up in. Our family decided to sell the home after my dad had passed away a few months ago. It was an incredibly difficult decision for us to make, but we all felt like it was the right one. Our home just didn't feel like a home anymore without him, so it was time for us to move on. I went back through the house one more time, a little bit teary-eyed to say goodbye. Goodbye to a place that I felt like I could return to no matter what. A place where I felt so safe. A place where I grew from a child to a woman. So I took my camera and I walked around the hallways and the different rooms and I approached my room and it dawned on me that it wasn't green anymore. Green is my favorite color and it was the color that I insisted my parents paint my room the moment we moved into that house. I also had the tiniest closet and the tiniest window and growing up a lot of my friends had big rooms and big windows and big closets and I would constantly complain to my mom and dad that I didn't have those things. My parents though reminded me to be thankful that I had a home let alone a room and they would say that if I wanted a bigger closet or a window that I should set some goals and work towards a bigger closet or a bigger window. Thinking back now it really forced me to think big and to not let my physical space define my dreams or ambitions. As I kept walking through the house, I decided to not let this moment be a sad one of letting go, but instead one of welcoming new beginnings. The family that's moving into this home is new to Canada, immigrating from Sri Lanka, and this is their first family home, just as it was for my family and I. It's basically the same story repeating itself after 25 years. I quickly realized that I wasn't leaving anything behind. I was taking with me the gift of memories. Memories of laughter, the sun beaming through those windows, learning to play the piano, my dad working on cars in the garage, my mom's fragrant cooking, my brother playing hockey in the basement. All happier times we shared in that home. Experiences in life shape us, but they do not define us. We're the ones that decide what to take with us and what to leave in the past for good. Sometimes we grow out of our closets and sometimes we grow into them. And sometimes we realize that the right kind of little is just enough. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please rate and like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Please help me. I'm trying to grow my channel. So share this video as much as you can. Anybody, tweet it out to the world. Just share it. Tell the world. Tell the world. Tell the world about my channel. That's it. Okay guys, thanks for watching.